Our journey begins in the Pacific, in the beautiful islands of Hawaii. Here we find Mauna Kea, a mountain that stretches its might far beneath the ocean's surface. If we measure from its base, deep down on the ocean floor, Mauna Kea stands as the tallest mountain on Earth, surpassing even the mighty Everest. This hidden titan, though less known, truly embodies the phrase, still waters run deep. So while Everest holds the title above sea level, Mauna Kea takes the crown when we look at the bigger picture. From the towering peaks of Mauna Kea, we shift our attention to the slowest creatures on Earth. The garden snail, a humble little creature, holds the title for the slowest land animal. It slides its way through life at a leisurely pace of only 0.03 miles per hour. That's right, even the notoriously slow sloth outpaces this mollusk. So next time you're feeling rushed, remember the garden snail and take things at your own pace. Now, let's tune into a sound that's baffled scientists worldwide. Imagine a low, persistent hum, almost imperceptible yet present. This is the hum, an auditory phenomenon reported globally. Its characteristics? A steady drone, akin to a distant diesel engine idling. Theories about its origin range from atmospheric vibrations to secret military experiments, yet none have been proven definitively. Despite advances in technology and scientific understanding, this low-frequency hum continues to baffle us, adding to Earth's unending mysteries. Our next stop takes us to the icy landscapes of Antarctica. Here, a peculiar phenomenon captivates the curious and confounds the scientific community. Lakes that seemingly vanish into thin air. These aren't your ordinary bodies of water but are known as ephemeral lakes. These transient lakes form on the surface of Antarctica's thick ice sheets during the warmer seasons when sunlight and mild temperatures cause ice to melt. But where does all that water go? The answer lies beneath the ice. The intense pressure from the weight of the ice creates fissures or cracks. The water from these ephemeral lakes drains into these fissures, disappearing from the surface and descending into the depths of the ice sheet. This process, known as hydrofracturing, can occur so rapidly that a large lake can vanish in just a matter of days. These vanishing lakes are a testament to the ever-changing and dynamic nature of our planet. From the icy cold of Antarctica, we move to the vibrant skies above. Fire rainbows, a spectacle of nature, are not born of rain. Instead, they are the offspring of ice crystals, high in the atmosphere, refracting light into stunning arcs of color. This phenomenon, as beautiful as it is rare, paints the sky with a palette that could make a rainbow blush. An ethereal display of nature's artistry, fire rainbows remind us of the endless wonders our planet offers. Truly, nature's beauty knows no bounds. Now, let's take flight with Earth's feathered navigators. Certain avian species like the homing pigeon have an astonishing ability to find their way home, no matter how far they travel. How you ask? They tap into Earth's magnetic field, using it as a natural GPS. These birds perceive this invisible force field, and with an innate sense of direction, they navigate the skies with remarkable precision. It's a fascinating showcase of nature's ingenuity. Who needs a compass when you have a built-in GPS? Next, we travel to the arid landscapes of Death Valley, California. Immerse yourself in the mystery of the moving rocks. In this parched, desolate terrain, rocks appear to move on their own, leaving behind trails like breadcrumbs in a fairy tale. This baffling phenomenon has puzzled scientists for decades. Some suggest that a perfect combination of rain, wind, and ice could set these stones in motion. Others speculate that an almost imperceptible slope of the terrain might be the culprit. Yet despite numerous theories, the exact cause remains enigmatic. These rocks, some weighing as much as 700 pounds, trace beautiful, intricate paths across the desert floor silently narrating an untold story. From gentle curves to sharp, jagged turns, their trails are as diverse as they are mysterious. So, next time you find yourself marveling at the wonders of nature, remember, even in the harsh terrain of Death Valley, the rocks seem to have a life of their own. Now, let's illuminate our minds with the electrifying power of lightning. Like an unceasing celestial drum roll, lightning strikes the earth approximately 100 times every second. Each of these strikes delivers an astounding 1 billion volts of electricity. Just imagine, this is enough energy to power a mid-sized city for a brief moment. It's a stark reminder of the raw, untamed power of nature constantly occurring all around us. 
With every strike, lightning reminds us of nature's awe-inspiring power. From the crackling skies we descend to the lush forests of Ecuador. Here, an extraordinary botanical spectacle unfolds. Meet the walking palm, a tree that challenges our understanding of stationary life. Its quirky name hints at its unique ability. It walks. Well, not in the way you and I do, but in its own slow and steady fashion. This tree doesn't stay rooted to one spot. Instead, it grows new roots towards areas with better sunlight, slowly relocating itself over time. The old roots die off as the new ones take over, allowing the tree to walk at a pace of a few centimeters a year. While it's no sprinter, this movement helps the tree thrive in the dense, competitive environment of the rainforest. The walking palm is a testament to the astounding adaptability of life on Earth. It's a gentle reminder that even in the face of challenges, life finds a way to move forward. In the depths of the forest, trees are on the move. Our journey now takes us back in time, to the age of the dinosaurs. We meet the horseshoe crabs, nature's time travelers. These remarkable creatures have been on Earth for over 450 million years, enduring through periods of mass extinction and drastic climate changes. Their hardy exoskeletons and unique reproductive strategies have contributed to their survival. These living fossils are a testament to life's tenacity and adaptability, reminding us of the enduring power of evolution and the marvels of our planet's biodiversity. From the ancient past, we move to an incredible journey that happens every year. Picture billions of tiny dust particles swept up from the vast plains of the Sahara Desert embarking on a voyage across the Atlantic Ocean. These microscopic adventurers travel thousands of miles, bringing life-sustaining nutrients to the Amazon rainforest and even reaching the white sandy beaches of the Caribbean. The journey of dust is a remarkable example of Earth's interconnected ecosystems. Our next stop takes us deep beneath Earth's surface. Hidden from the light of day, a subterranean wonderland unfolds in the heart of our planet. Vast networks of caves, carved out over eons by the ceaseless work of water and time, sprawl within Earth's crust, forming an intricate web of silent, dark corridors. These labyrinthine passages, some of which stretch for miles, have not all known the footfall of explorers, remaining as pristine and untouched as the day they were formed. But these caves are far from lifeless. They are sanctuaries for a variety of creatures, from bats to blind fish, each adapted to survive in this unique, shadowy realm. There's a high chance that within these uncharted territories, new species are lurking, waiting for their moment of discovery. These geological masterpieces, with their stunning stalactites and stalagmites, remind us that beauty can flourish even in the darkest corners. Beneath our feet lies a world waiting to be explored. Finally, we arrive at the shores of the Singing Beach in Massachusetts. This is one of the unique places on Earth where the sands sing, a phenomenon caused by the friction between sand particles. It's a captivating symphony of nature, a mysterious whispering song that echoes with every step. Similar beaches can be found in other parts of the world, from the Gobi Desert to the dunes of Death Valley. The singing sands serve as a harmonious end to our extraordinary journey.